Hello? Hello, this is Mr. Barry? Yes, yes. Well, this is Ted Travis from the Sheriff's Office. How are you? Well, I'm doing pretty good, I guess. Yeah, I was okay. just I was just over there uh, pulling our, our records. So uh, yeah, I'm in back in Bellevue now. How can I help you? Uh, yes, I, I I filed a complaint online yesterday uh, with a uh, uh, officer S. Kennedy. Uh, uh -huh. He uh, violated my rights. I was on a public easement, uh, exercising all of my First Amendment act, uh, rights at one time, all five elements. Uh, and uh, he violated my Fourth Amendment by forcing me to ID under penalty of arrest, under threat of arrest. Okay, did you read County Ordinance 1595? Oh, I, I did, but that doesn't apply to me. That has to do with if I were going out in the road roadway uh, either receiving something or handing something out. I was doing neither. I was, on, I was standing on public easement on a traditional public forum exercising my, all of my First Amendment rights, but I wasn't going into the roadway to exchange anything or receive anything. So it says for the purpose of distributing materials. Yes, and I, and I wasn't I was holding a sign, but I wasn't distributing anything. In other words, that has to do with me going out in the roadway, which would could be considered a crime and, and public nuisance uh, to go out in the roadway. Now, me being within four feet of a roadway, that's on a, still on a public easement. That doesn't have anything to do with what I was doing. Okay, I interpret it as you standing there with a the sign. It's for the purpose of distributing that material that's on the sign. Okay, so uh, we're going to have to litigate. Sounds like it. Okay. All right. I was hoping that, you know, that uh, y'all might, you know, because I've always had pretty good, uh, I'm always litigating, man. I, I'm, I'm always, always uh, distributing, man, all through the county. I'm everywhere distributing. So, uh, and I'll, I'll, I'll be back out on that same uh, stretch over there, that same easement, doing what I was doing before. And if I get uh, standing, uh, you know, I already have standing with the, with the uh, threat of arrest. But if I get a, a, a ticket for it, or if I get arrested, then, you know, it'll be even more. Don't want to... I'm surprised you need to park on the right-of-way. Uh, I, I can park on the right-of-way. Really? Yeah, I can, yeah. Yep, I park on the right-of-way all over Florida. Everywhere over Florida. In Alabama. Yep. Yeah. There's no. I don't see. I see. I don't see why y'all don't y'all don't study up on this stuff right here. That ordinance has to do with uh, uh, with being a, a nuisance on the roadway and being a, a, a public uh, a hazard. You notice it said that it didn't have anything to do with uh, distributing information on a uh, on a walkway. It had to do with a road. There was a second ordinance that says it's not to be construed as interfering with. Uh, that same right on on the pub walkway itself, which meant with meant the easement. It has to all has to do it all has to do with with the roadway. It says directed towards pedestrians on sidewalks. Yeah, and 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 that ordinance is designed to protect people from being run over. Yeah, well, Castle Rock versus Gonzalez, y'all have no uh, uh, duty or lawful duty. Uh, no, it sounds like y'all, y'all just don't learn anything, so I'm going to have to educate you. Take care. Okay, you too.